still with that fault. I'm still wearing the same clothes, in the same position I was in the last game. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. You think you're gonna sit? Nah. You can drive. Episode, you like got knocked out one punch. Better quit playing. Carruthers said she took a real pounding. Pause? Maybe if he had been a little firmer in the beginning, he wouldn't be in this situation now. I imagine that Neanderthal routine is a big hit with the ladies, Galloway. So you telling me Women love me, Phelps. I have no complexity. They know exactly what they're going to get. I understand, like, they fight. Like, if the woman is fighting you back, you have the right to, like, hit her back. But, like, they just cool with a woman just walking in, smacking a woman and walking out. They, they just good with it. No, no assault charges, nothing. Dang, I can't believe it back then. I couldn't. Plus, I think this is when racism was still a uh, big thing. So, uh, yeah. This game is still beautiful. Oh. Oh. Definitely show them. God dang it, now I gotta look for his freaking number. Mendez. Apartment 16. Not all the way up there? Wow, that looks like it. Maybe a freaking elevator. Of course, there's no freaking elevator. How many flights? I just heard of. Here, the apartment's up on the top floor. Of course it is. They couldn't give us a freaking. Elevator. No, they say you walking up all freaking four flights of freaking stairs. Because we don't like you. Okay, I was about to say. Don't bother knocking, just kick the door in. Alright. Take a look around and see what you can find. This is a big apartment. How much you pay? I thought that was a pack of condoms. I don't think so. Just open it up to make sure. Oh. Oh. Brothers could match the color and brand of the body. Alonzo? Alonzo? Consistent with Celine's injuries, and the blood can be typed. We have the murder weapon. We better get Pinker down here. Why keep it? Why not throw it away? You think these clowns are geniuses? Thank your stars you caught a break, and Captain Donald will begin to like you. Hey, what gives? LAPD, you're under arrest. God. Do not lose that son of a bitch. I'll go get our wheels. You gonna, you're just gonna get out all slow, all calm. Mendez, stop right there! Yo, Mendez. Hey, this is the second Mexican. Okay. I'm not even joking. This is like the second Mexican that killed somebody and did something wrong. What does GTA guy do? I mean, what does Rockstar guy do? I'm so glad he did see that. You don't need to do this, Alonzo! Yeah. Oh, you got to do a victory jump. You better not be getting in that car. You better not be getting in that car. You better not be getting in that car. Get in and drive. Of course. Hit him. Clean this asshole off the road. I got an idea. Get him next to my window, Cole. Keep me alongside his vehicle, and I'll stop the son of a bitch. Hit him, Cole. Spin him out. I'll try to shoot out his tires. Wish me luck. You're under arrest for the murder of Celine Henry. Get out the car. Alright. 
Put your hands in the air. Uh, this car is on fire. Maybe we should like, like get away from it. You know? Yeah, I thought it was Henry. <laughs> I was even freaking timing this. The timer starts now. I ain't saying a goddamn thing. You did a grand job, lads. Phelps, that's quite a way to acquit yourself in your first outing as a homicide investigator. Yeah. It seems the city has a new and vengeful guardian. Yeah. Considering the evidence against your suspect and the thoroughness with which a report was compiled, I foresee a safe passage through the courts, and the DA agrees with me. Yeah. Brutality on a scale such as this deserves retribution. Yeah. The people. Ooh, let me and get a cut. the press of this city demanded. You don't that much? Oh, you ain't gonna give me a. That's messed up. He didn't even drink it. And it wasn't even that filled up. It was like a sip. The suspect is is in the bag. Even if you did leave Jacob sweating in central lockup. <laughs> Poor Jacob. Um, the, I'm like, what was that? This game is still this pain <laughs> to cool the lava you pump through my veins, cause I'm burning. I'm burning. Only one that thinks that thinks that. Only one that thinks that. What's that? What we watching Law and Order? <laughs> oh. That's fucked up. <laughs> he just molly walked. Did you kill her? Galloway. What's wrong with people in this freaking city? We God, just drop her keys. This man just walk up and just hit her with a freaking crowbar. <laughs> yeah, I'll bring him. He's my partner, after all. What have we got? New case. White female dumped in plain sight in the grass at the end of Hill Street. Hacks are all over it. Captain's trying to fend him off. That sounds yeah. awfully similar. Mm -hmm. The first rule of police work is make no assumptions until you've seen the evidence. Skipper wants you to have your newspaper face on, college boy. Don't touch me. I think I know the place where they found the lady. It overlooks Sunset Boulevard. Let's go. You driving, right? Since you hey, don't want to get the you call. think those vice boys get in there? I think it makes sense, right? You got the call, you drive. Is that correct? Okay, you walk into some new. See, look, 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 look. I'm already down here. I'm already out the door. Guess what? He just now walking out the door. Why would you open the other door? Okay. You're behind the wheel. Small yeah, I thought I was gonna say fuck shit. <laughs> you did a decent job in the head of the case, though. Not bad for your first time at bat. Thanks, Rusty. Phone, I swear. Don't go getting ahead of yourself. That's one clearance under your belt. Now it's a new day with a new dead lady that needs our attention. No assumptions until we see the evidence, right? Right. See, I knew you were a fast learner, Phelps. Yeah. You might get along after all. Well, Galloway, what you did in the last episode, I don't know about that friendship anymore. Freaking guy got knocked out by one punch. One punch. Let me tell y'all, he got knocked out by one punch. He didn't even help me for the rest of the fight. He just got knocked out by one punch. That's when he stopped being my partner. Knocked out. <laughs> Now, boys, boys, you know as much as I do. I'll be holding a press conference once the autopsy is being completed. Yeah, you tell them. I have two of my finest investigators on the case. 
fresh from bringing down the sword of justice on the crazed sex... Captain, aren't Mendes. there similarities between this murder and the murder of Celine Henry? And of Elizabeth Short, for that matter. So you don't matter. believe there's a crazed sex killer at large boys, preying on women? Boys, be sensible. Well, I don't think we have the greatest crazy. police force in all the world, with the greatest scientific crazy. investigators at our disposal. How can any killer continue to beat that? Yeah. Be advised. We keep the gas chamber at San Quentin primed for the sons of Cain who continue to believe they can take a life in the city of angels. Yeah, right. Any new leads in the Dahlia case? Run along, boys, and let these officers get to work. We yeah. have God's work to do here, and it can't be delayed. God. What do we have, kick? Captain? Another woman sacrificed. Oh, Speak to Carruthers. I want daily reports, gentlemen. Shouldn't you be working? Detective, I was first on scene. You said that. So what's going on over there? Did you say it? This is a secure area. You all need to leave. Did you say it? Who said it? This is a crime scene. All of you move along. No other reporter. You find her, Gonzalez? Oh, he's not said me. It. Family out for a stroll. I was first reporting. And you show me the body. It's under the pepper tree, this way. That's the guy from the pepper Pepper tree. Pe pe pepper tree. Is this woman gonna be naked? Because I don't got time for that. Can't be much help to you, Phelps. Of course she's naked. Besides the The stomping angle in the Henry case, was it reported in the press? Sure was. Every detail a copycat would want was there in the story. Oh. I get to the body in a second. Got a puss. Ooh, take that five dollars. Just slip it the in the pocket. The motive was robbery. Why not take the money? Just slip that in your pocket. No one is gonna notice. Unless they already went through it. Well, we have a name. Can you run Deirdre Muller by R and I? Back in a second. Deirdre. Down. Like I'm telling you, man, just just slip, you just slip that in your pocket real quick. Okay. Put that back. Oh, oh, she got a bush. Yeah. I mean, looks like she was tied up. Well, it does at first, but that would leave a mark on her other wrist too. I think her watch might have been torn off. How tight does she have? Watch. I don't know if I could be all this close. Look at your mark. It's very distinctive. Yeah. I'll do some comparisons back what at the, the lab and get back to you. Y'all hear that static? I'm not tripping, right? Y'all heard that static, too. Thanks very much for your help. What's this mark? A cut on a finger. Fourth finger, left hand. A wedding or engagement ring. Violently removed. Why you gotta be so violent? Like, dang. So rude. Dang, he stepped on her? Is he gonna, he's not gonna say nothing like that? Alright. Hello? Detectives! Oh, okay. R&I right. says a Deidre Mahler of 130 North Bonnie She's Bray was reported cool, missing cool. this morning by her husband, Hugo Mahler. What'd I tell you? Grab the husband, take him downtown, and work him over. We could have this wrapped up by lunchtime. What about not making assumptions and going on the evidence? Okay, I'm making sure my headphones are intact. Okay. Galloway! God, freaking walk slow. Oh, like he ain't got no care in the world. 
I was gonna make more, but after this video, I don't think I can survive this video. I'm gonna be tired. You can drive. My boy thought he was gonna sit past me. Nah. Still might be some playing the boyfriend angle. I thought we were on our way to lock up the husband. If it doesn't work out, that is. Deirdre Muller has suffered enough. More than enough. You shouldn't make disparaging comments about her without even the slightest inkling of what she was like. She was a woman, wasn't she? You know, around about my third divorce, I realized women might not be the pure angels we imagine. You're married, ain't you, Phelps? Don't make any insinuations about my wife. Hey, she's a woman. She's the mother of my children. <laughs> you're a father, Cole? But don't tell me your eye don't bend. This conversation is over. I didn't even know that. I didn't even know I had a wife. I didn't even know I had a kid. Dang. I need to set an example. One, two, three, four. How many niggers are in my store? Phelps and Galloway, LAPD. Is your father home? He'll be home soon. He's been out looking for mommy. What's your name, miss? Michelle Eloise Mahler. Oh, your mother's dead. Can we come in? I suppose so. Your mother's dead. Sit her down. Thank you. Sit her down. Could you have right. a seat for me, Michelle? And be like, your mom got killed. Just, just say it to her face. Just, just say it straight to her face. He's gonna smoke. We're gonna have house. a look around. He's gonna look around. He's gonna look around the house like, like that. He'll be back any moment. Just sit tight. Bitch, I'm still here. Tell me something. He'll be back in a second. I'm still here. Nope. Yeah. Can we zoom in on it? Not sure this means much. But can we zoom in on it? What kind of what kind of cupcakes are those? My partner will explain everything when he gets back. Okay? Really? There's a nothing cup? to worry about. Nope. My boy said there's nothing to worry about. Why are you lying to her? Dang. Dude. No good What's to up, me. <laughs> okay. Dude. Uh. Not everything here is going to be relevant. How you like them lemons? I don't freaking know. He didn't give me much with that one. Dang, they bait. Dang, this girl just see. They need a chaperone this child. This girl just wasting all this food in here. Baking everything. Elgin wristwatch. Probably the same one snatched from her body. Her booty? I said booty. Her body. But I don't know what a No sign of a wedding ring. Mason watching rings? Okay. What you gonna do when they come for you? Size 38? There's gonna have to be something. Work boots. Size eights. Dang. Big foot mother. Okay, I kinda assumed that was gonna be the same thing, man. Oh, she played guitar? Oh, oh violin? Oh, snap. Dang, look at that little glisten. Shing! Okay. I need to do a Fallout 4 video for me. Is this her diary? This isn't what we're looking for. Can we open it though? Check your pussy. Nope. No. Put I know. We ain't got time for that, my boy. Is this about mommy? Daddy is trying to find her. Please tell me she's okay. Nope, she's not. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, Michelle, but your mother is dead. <laughs> that quick? 
Do you think you could answer a few questions for us? I could try. Oh, where the tears at? Oh. When did you last see your mother? Yesterday afternoon. I went to a dance at Belmont High. Mommy was supposed to pick me up, but she didn't show. So what did you do then? I was upset. Daddy came instead. And did he come and get you? Of course. Some boys offered me a ride home, but that's not the right thing to do. So you were hanging around the school for quite a while. What happened with your father? I don't know. I called and called and finally he answered. He came straight away then. Son of a bitch. Listen here, you little shit. I, you, I, I, you, don't, don't be freaking... Some of your mother's right? jewelry was missing. Can you describe her things? A ring, a watch. You watch your mom that closely? If he asked me that, but like, I never uh, paid much nigga, attention to that stuff. different... <laughs> I was not paying attention. So, oh, God. Yeah, uh, oh, d shit. Uh, uh... <laughs> I know it's painful, Michelle, but this may be important. She wore a wedding ring? Mommy chose it herself. Yeah. A rose gold wedding band and a matching diamond and ruby engagement ring. Dang. She wore a watch? How yes. Much? A yellow gold Elgin watch. Daddy bought it for her birthday. They had a fight. It was kind of a makeup present. Oh, I swear to God. I've Your mom saying. and dad are uh, happily married? What are you saying? Of course they are. Woman? They weren't happy, were they, Michelle? Did your father ever hit your mother? Just the once. Just the once? She what said kind she of would language? leave him if he ever did it again. He bought her a brooch pin to make up for it. This was it just and he always once. wore her golden butterfly. Kind of shit is that? Hey, that's the name Thanks, Miss Muller. Okay. You've been very brave. Hey! What kids? Daddy, the police are room, here. Michelle. I'll talk to the police. Daddy, mommy is gone. Go to your room, young lady. She's not even out of school. You can't come in here interrogating her like she's your some kind of... Your wife was found murdered this morning. Found? What the... But, but she only... We have some questions that we would like to ask you. Uh... Sure, yeah. Yeah, I'll do my best. Oh, my God. You know what? We're gonna go... Your wife went to pick up Michelle? Yes. That's right. We got him. What happened, Hugo? You got any theories? Because we're starting to like you for this. Yeah. The car park by the school is kind of dark. Uh, maybe somebody jumped her there. Did you try the parking lot? Well, alrighty then. What size shoe do you wear, Mr. Muller? Why do you ask? It's routine, sir. Simple process of elimination. Nines, I think. Wrong. You know anyone who wears a smallest men's shoe who had a major grudge against your wife? Is there something you would like to tell us, Hugo? Oh, my God. No, Phelps. I do not. Phelps. You finished making hints? Phelps, you fucking idiot. You saw, you saw him, you saw the fucking shoes on the floor. You know he does so not So you were here all night? Size nine. You stayed in Why while your you wife went that? out to pick up your daughter? Why? Yes, that's correct. You know what, I don't even fucking care. God. You didn't go anywhere? No, I was here the whole time. Screw it, Phelps. You're a dumbass. You you're, phoned in a missing persons dumbass. report this morning? Nigga know damn well. Yeah, that's right. He went in there. Uh, I could have sworn we saw eight. My wife didn't come home last night. She left around... She left around 9.30. Uh, Michelle was out of dance. She called me to let me know that Deidre didn't turn up. Was your wife unreliable? No. You know what? This is some bullshit. Your wife was beaten and then strangled. 
In your case, you have no alibi and a history of violence towards your wife. That's not, that's not true, God damn it. I think you set this up, Hugo. I think you kicked up a fuss about staying home for an alibi. Then you followed your wife and murdered her. Okay, that's a little... You're out of your mind coming in here, making accusations like that. Come out into the yard and I'll make you take that back, mister. Bitch, I'll whoop your ass. <laughs> Try me. Getting hostile with us is a very bad idea, Hugo. I'm no murderer. Make some arrangements for your daughter and then present yourself to Central Station for questioning. You gotta be kidding me, Phelps. Put the cuffs on it. This is an outrage. I didn't kill my wife. Your daughter is in the next room, Muller, so I'm giving you a break. Don't make me change my mind, and don't make me come looking for you. Ugh, I want to start this one over. We should go back in there and bust him. his ass. One, we need to break his alibi. Check phone records, canvas the neighbors. Two, we have motor.